These are your confessions. Please take whatever resonates and leave whatever don't. I am back with another confessions. It's been a minute since I've done one of these, but I am here. Um, let's see what comes out at this time. Just know that energy is flowing. So this could be past, this could be present, this could be future. Let's dive into it. Know that this is for all signs, all elements, earth, air, water, and fire. So just take whatever resonates, leave whatever don't, you guys. And always check the description of the videos for any information. All right, let's tap in. Spirit, please show us a message for this confession. What is it that you want the collective to know? They're confused. Someone is confused here. What are they confused about, Spirit? Show us more. Lust put me away, but I love you. So they're confused because they allow lust to put them away. And they're realizing that they actually love you. So the confusion is wrapped around how could I? Why did I? Why did I pull away from this person? Why did I? So, yeah. This person is confused on how could they let someone like you slip away. Show us more on this energy. Show us more on this energy for this confession spirit. Karmic is spying on your every move. Post. They're obsessed. Alright, so this karmic is obsessed. Now, for some of you, this can go several different ways. For some of you, the karmic is this person that is claiming that they love you and and wanting to you know put the blame on lust lust put me away oh my gosh that's why i love or that's why this happened but i really do love you i love you but this could be a karmic all along so it was meant for this to happen anyway it was a lesson out of the situation and that's that hopefully you learned your lesson from this situation with this person now for some of you it could be the situation where the person who felt like lust put them away because the lust was the karmic that they were dealing with and they're realizing that they really love you and they don't see how this karmic allowed them to, you know, how they allowed the karmic to take over. Um, but they could be telling you that this karmic is spying on your every move and they are obsessed with you. We have fake friends. So this person is realizing that they have fake friends. Like, they really didn't have my back. They allowed this to happen. They laughing behind my back. Okay, hotel key. So, the hotel key, this person could have been seeing this person at hotels, um, having meetups, rendezvous with this person at hotels. They tapped and hacked your phone. This could have been the karmic that tapped and hacked your phone or tapped and hacked this person's phone. This person could be an Aquarius that you're dealing with. You can you could be an Aquarius or it could be the karmic. But I feel like this could be you or this person. But please take it however it resonates for your situation. Nightmares of the karmic. Someone is having nightmares of this person. Whew. Someone is a karmic mother. Someone could have a karmic mother that is playing a part of this situation. That could be a part of the fake friends. Fake friends could be fake family. Um, for some of you, this fake mother, I mean fake mother. Oh, it could be a fake mother. <laughs> Um, literally being said like that, but this could be a, um, karmic mother as far as baby mother, a child's mother. Okay. Someone feel like, um, yeah, this person could be a stripper or a prostitute or someone could have been into strippers and prostitutes and this situation is backfiring for them. Mm. Well then they have baby mamas. Um, due to this, maybe someone end up having another baby mother by dealing with a stripper or a prostitute or however this go. Um, but yeah, it's like someone made a really lousy choice here and it, it caused, um, a mess of destruction for them and you for this connection is no longer apparently because they do feel at a loss. Show us more on this energy for this confessions. Show us more on this energy for this confession. Show us more on this energy for this confession. 
show us more of this energy for this confession. Yeah, something backfired majorly. Show us more on this confessions. Family, blood ties, inner circle could have been the fake friends, as mentioned, especially with the karmic mother being involved here. Or this could be someone that is someone to have children or child with. We have intervention, rescue, others involved. Exactly. All right. What else, spirit? Gossip, petty, jealousy, envy. Yeah, that's why they're spying heavy. Okay. Um, someone is feeling very embarrassed of their appearance due to what has been said, due to this gossip. Uh, you know, lies could have been told along with some truth. Um, but this person is feeling embarrassed due to this because it's like, damn, I love my divine feminine for this situation. Um, or you could be the divine feminine here. Um, however it is go, but this person is definitely feeling it. Spirit, show us a message for this confession. Show us more on this energy for this confession. Show us more on this energy for this confession. Coffin. Someone is wanting the latest to rest here. It could be gossip due to an ending, due to some type of uh, maybe a, the death could have been involved here because we do have family here. Um, and this coffin, it could be a family member, something going on here that's being exposed or that's why something is backfiring. So some, maybe someone thought that this, or this is just due to an ending of, a, of this connection with you. Um, and you could be the privileged lady here. You're held in high honor. So this is why it's backfiring because someone is definitely highly favored. And this person is in despair due to this. Someone could be age 32. Um, someone could be age 25. Um, or these numbers could resonate with you in other ways. The number 7, the number 5, 3, 12, 19, 10, 1 could be significant for someone. Whether this is your birthday, their birthday, the third party, the uh, karmic birthday, um, one of the karmic family members' birthday. Something here, but there's an ending here and someone is privileged. Someone is walking out. Um, someone is walking out privileged, walking out like this, while the other person is walking out like this. Like, damn, how did I do that? How did I let this happen? How could I? Why did I? Confusion. Spirit, show us a message for this confession. What else do they want to confess here? Let's get more on this coffin. Let's get more details on this coffin. Show us more on the coffin. To a source, someone could be blocking off communication. Yeah, so there was an ending due to a connection. And someone is feeling embarrassed because... It's like they know that they're never going to have an opportunity with you again or with this privileged lady or privileged man, however this is. Someone is feeling at a major, feeling a major loss here. A major loss. Show us a message for this confession. Yeah, it could be gossip about someone dealing with these stripper and prostitutes. It's definitely some, some, some gossip going on here. It's like what this person plan was, it ended up turning out totally opposite. So I don't know, they thought, you know, I guess they thought they was going to go with this other party. Um, and, but now they're realizing it's just lust or whatnot. They thought they was going to go with this karmic or deal with this other person and live this happily ever after life or have or just have fun and have no problems because they felt they may have felt like this karmic was privileged but kind of find out that you're actually the privileged lady or privileged man but that's how it backfired now this person is wanting to be rescued from this situation they feel so embarrassed due to their choice due to what they have done show us more for this confession spirit someone could be dealing with a fire sign aries leo sagittarius 
or this person is looking at you in this energy of this queen of rods someone who is very confident beautiful attractive wow this person like damn you was my match how did i how could i so this person is looking at you like this whereas you possibly not even looking at this person in this light anymore or if you ever was but either way this person is looking at you like this and still looking at themselves like this like this is what we could still have but i don't think you are seeing this like that some of you you're coming into connection with your with the with your true partner and this person just isn't it anymore someone made a foolish decision this person know this they know this this is so they're confused. They know they made the wrong decision, but they're confused on how could I make such a foolish choice? I know I made this decision, but how could I make this dumb choice? This was really dumb of me. Like, that's what someone is feeling. Yeah, three of swords due to this karmic, due to this third party. Now they're heartbroken. Show us more three emperor in reverse yeah someone has lost total control out of this it's like that's why they're feeling embarrassed that's why they're feeling like and they're feeling like like nothing that they're doing is going the way they want it to go someone could be dealing with a cancer or aries show us more of this chariot it's like this person is losing faith and moving forward show us more of this chariot page of cups in reverse yeah this could be the person that's being petty um because this energy is the page of cups is definitely petty energy someone who's being very childish or having a temper tantrum or this could be them being or that this is what they were doing to try to have that control but due to the emperor being in reverse they lost this control so they're losing that and you could be rejecting them or rejecting an apology from this person and you're going into a real connection, true love connection with someone else. Someone that you're meant to be with. Yeah, that's how I was feeling that pettiness for sure. That five of swords energy. Like this person could have been very, very petty trying to start some. I feel like bully you. This was a bully here. This person was trying to bully you or this person was bullying this person. It's one way or the other. It's a bully here. Whether this is the person... But I feel like, no, I feel like this is this person that pulled away from you. And they're using this lame excuse of lust. Lust put me away. The prostitutes and the um and the uh, strippers is what put me away. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Why did I? No. They're using this I love you card to make themselves look like, oh, like pity. Like, no. So, yeah, justice is being served here. And the justice for this situation is just by closing out this cycle. Ending this. Okay? Um, I feel like you're going into a new soulmate connection here with this Six of Cups. Um, this could be a past life connection. Past lover. Past life connection. Or past lover this lifetime. Show us more. I feel like you're putting away the childish behavior. Putting away certain people that was childish you're healing yeah you could be healing things with a past lover and this person may want to heal it with you but i feel like that is just it's not going to happen that way yeah someone is steady holding on to you judgment they want a renewal i feel like for some of you like i say you're about to come into another connection yeah because this person like they repeat the same patterns this is not the same pattern occur and then they're back in a state of confusion i am confused why did i do that how did i do that but you just did this last month or a week a week ago or a year ago the same patterns is being repeated so why are you confused <laughs> like that's what i'm getting like this person just keep repeating things and they're they're back into square one confusion why because they're they're in their low vibrational energy they're toxic right now they're not doing any self-healing whereas you have done the work you heal and you're you're choosing to walk away from this situation move away from the situation and focus on yourself or this is what you have done you have healed you have an angel here that's assistant or have helped you investing into yourself 
So you can heal. So you can move forward from this conflict, from this competition that this person put you in. And not only that, that opens your third eye and helps you see clearly about the situation and what this person is to you or was to you. Like, okay, I see what this is now. So that's the lesson that you learned. Um, and this helped you become more wiser and have this brand new beginning here and great fortune. But this was destined to happen this way. It was definitely destined to happen, happen this way. You needed to be given this this way so you can see clearly about the situation. Otherwise, it would have been a fog and you could have repeated the same cycles with this person over and over again. Allow this to happen over and over again. But I feel like due to this, how this happened, you needed this to happen this way so you could see, okay, I would never deal with you ever again or i will never deal with your kind again you seeing something more clearly not just within this person but in within this the entity the the energy that was surrounding this person so whether it's with this person or with another being that come around you would pick up on it so this was a lesson for yourself which is great um Let me see what else for this confession spirit. Anything else for this confessions? Yeah, this person is, <laughs> it's like they, um, they're only, they're only, um, embarrassed because you're looking good. You're looking good. You're doing well. You're doing possibly even better without them and their dirty laundry. Listen, their dirty laundry is being spoken about gossip about your relationship it's gossip about it and you know the truth is being revealed others can see you know it's a lot of clarity not only you have picked up on this person but others see right through this person as well so it's a lot of clarity that's being shed and this person don't like the fact that they're being basically broadcast <laughs> or they feel this way they feel like the spotlight is on them in a negative way and they don't like that they do not like that. They find you very attractive. And they feel like maybe, you know, due to the, this could be someone who's um who's highly attractive as well. And they may feel like by their good looks that you, you know, maybe they would have you back. That's that ego, their ego speaking. But it looked like this is a wrap because you don't even look at them how they feel about themselves. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like they they're they're this is this could have been how they were. But I feel like the death of the ego is definitely here now. So their ego is definitely decreasing for sure. Because they're coming out again as the embarrassed clown, okay? <laughs> they're embarrassed of their appearance. Show us a message here for this confession. Confessions. They want to claim you again. They feel like if you just talk to them, they can tell you, like, get you to, I don't know, like they can charm you with their voice or charm you with their talks or their dirty talk. They want to make it official with you. They want to claim you. But it just looks like it's not going to happen on your behalf. You're not letting this happen. Whoever this is. Yeah, someone is wanting to turn around. 360, all views, turn around. They want to turn this all around because it's looking bad on them now. They don't like looking bad. So they want to have conversations over drinks. Because they want their control back. They want to take over. That's why. Remember, they lost control. This emperor in reverse, definitely a loss of control. Okay? With the three of swords. They're heartbroken over this. They feel foolish, fool in reverse for sure. So not only did you learn a lesson due to this person behavior, but they had to, this was the point of this. This needed to happen. This was destined to happen. This person needed to learn a lesson about themselves. They can't keep doing this. Can't keep blaming it on lust. Oh, lust did it. Oh, you know, but I love you. What? <laughs> lust put me away, but I love you. Like, you see, I love you. And Cap, like, no, I love. What love got to do with it? What love got to do, got to do with it? 
So this person is majorly confused because they keep making the same choices and they lost out on a major person in their life. And it's no comeback. So if you're in a situation where like, yes, this person can have me back. I do, you know, if they change, no, this not you. This not you then. Because this is a situation where someone is, have seen you coming out as a privileged lady okay you have seen your worth now you've done the work here you have healed here this person have not and they're not going to they're it's like they're repeating it over and over and over this person could be maybe they're cursed and they're just continuing to do this out of life over and over they curse itself you know by making this choice Ah, they got to come out of this by wanting to surrender and, you know, let go of this lustful behavior or whatever. Hotel key strippers and prostitutes, okay? Yeah, whatever this person plan was, it backfired because they thought that they could continue to play the, play the field. Because they thought they looked so good that, you know, they could always have what they want with you. But not realizing they met they match. Clearly, they met they match. Okay? I could be speaking to two fire signs, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Or you could um, be, it could be a Scorpio here with the death here. Um, it could be an Aquarius, as mentioned in the cards. And also the star coming out, Aquarius energy, Scorpio energy, again, with the judgment. Um, yeah, those are the main signs. Also, well, yeah, Aquarius, you came out a couple times. Aries as well. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and Cancer energy is here. So, however you are placed in this reading. But those signs could be placements of you. Or if you didn't hear the sign, but this, this is the message for your situation, then that's just what it is. The energy don't lie. Let's get a message. So... I know how strong you are, yet I feel so protective over you. So, what? Anyways, <laughs> so this person wants to, this could be something that they want to say, like, you know, they see how strong you are because you're not giving in to their, you're not giving in to their, their, their ways, okay? You're not taking the bait here. Um, so they're, they want, and it's like they want to say this to you. Like, I know how strong you are, but, but yet I feel so protective over you. Like, that's their, it's like this person could be very charming with their words or know what to say. But I feel like you a step ahead, like 10 steps ahead. And you, you peep this person's character now. You know exactly what you're, you're putting up with. So whatever they say is not working, which is why the coffin is here. There's a complete ending here. I'm working hard on my finances for you, for us, for our future. This person could be trying to, you know, come back in by saying that, like, you know, I, I'm doing everything I need to do to make it work. And you're like, what? No. Again, shall I say this again? Yes, I shall. The Knight of Pentacles in reverse is completely repeated patterns, okay? Along with the Seven of Cups, I mean, yeah, this person definitely just put on illusions here they're not even truthful with their with themselves i'm a letter i'm a letter person because of you i feel more optimistic and full of life so this person might like writing letters or feel like that would be best if they wrote you a letter or something like that to get to you but i feel like i said like i said i don't feel like that's working either i daydream of our future together those days are over with so yeah, this person just lost out on a good one. That's what it looked like. It looked like this person needs to go through their lessons so these patterns won't continue so they can progress in this lifetime instead of repeating those same patterns. But it definitely looked like this person is stuck in those patterns, which is why they're confused. Like, if you just do the work, then you would come out of this confusion. Um, Yeah. So that is it for this Confessions. Um, this person is just, that's what they want to say. I'm confused. I don't know. I don't know what made me, I don't know. It was just, it had to have been a lust. <laughs> yeah, okay. 
All right, but that's it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this confession. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Thank you to all new subscribers, all returning subscribers, and all members. Um, and until next time, many blessings.